please don't forget to subscribe because a lot of people that watch my videos don't subscribe apparently and hit that bell so you stay informed with the latest and greatest videos from this channel i'm also live every day on twitch.tv slash hasanabi after 11 a.m pacific oh again please okay instead of a greek god because you should would say he's like a greek god he's a turkish god okay somebody clip me hassan i want to be your friend let's hang out they all choose hassan Ooh. yeah or choose hassan hassan is probably the most attractive Ooh. Okay, so I guess my first would be Hassan. <laughs> there, there. Hassan's really cute. Wait, what go back to my Hassan beard there, by the way. That beard looked fucking serious. God damn, it it really did, dude. You had a powerful beard. It looked like Stannis Barat. Yeah, but your back, your fucking wall was, was that white trash, wall sucked, dude. dude. Now you look like you're inside of the jungle. That's right. If you had this kind of beard back then with this exact same fit, you would literally look like you're still in Vietnam or something. <laughs> like you're not, you're like a... Everybody was crying, screaming, praying yeah. to God. You're like, you're That's like... That's when I realized there is no God. Yeah, you look like you're... This is the only way you can combat your PTSD is by yeah. still living in Vietnam. A part of your brain is still there. I was in Grenada. Yeah. Three days of hell. This is what Jane Fonda took from you, Western yeah. man. I look like the dude who got... I actually look like the dude who got PTSD from Firefest, dude. I'm uh, like, they, yeah. they didn't have enough tents. The sandwiches were only half assembled. And there was no dance you music whatsoever. You don't love Spirit of Justice. You love I thought your I was going to die. Book Stannis has a beard based. Will gets it right again. <laughs> Hassan's really cute. What if I said that Hassan's better looking than you? I think that he has a very nice body. I guess Hassan's the hottest. <laughs> He's cute. Oh. The amount oh, of- Oh, he's really good looking. I'm seeing this one. Oh my god. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah. He's actually so handsome. And Hassan is just really, really super, super hot. <laughs> <laughs> but the same I'll tell you what Hassan. bar I work at. You can come see me. Ooh. Because I think everybody says it, but I, I like Hassan a lot. <laughs> <laughs> because you're like really hot. <laughs> Would you do me and Hassan at the same time? I know. I just want to be his friend, dude. <laughs> I just want to know him. <laughs> I just want to suck his dick, dude. Even... <laughs> That's all. No, no, you can beat it up anytime, Hassan, okay? That's what uh, okay, like, dude. Okay. Yeah, no. Oh, Chad's talking about Hassan? <laughs> Don't talk about Hassan. <laughs> Why, did you make... Why did you make Will watch this? This is, like, terrible. I mean, I, I watched this. I've like reacted. Hey guys, uh, everybody in chat. Uh, by the way, I'm selling something on uh, Instagram Marketplace. It's my dick. It's, it's nearly unused. Uh, I mean, me too. I don't like, use it's it. not I'm like... just gonna go ahead and list. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it up there. If anybody's looking for a freckled cock, uh, bitch, it's not like I use my dick either. You barely it. out of the box, dude. Barely out of the box. Like we're in the same situation. The only thing, the only one I get an action out of this is is. This guy. I can feel it calling in the air tonight. Dude, Spalding should cut an ad with you. That'd be just a black uh. and white ad of you coming into a room and you're like, mm. and I've been waiting for this moment for all my life. Hold on. <laughs> Wait, what are they selling? They're like the most fuckable basketballs? Like this. No, the slogan would be something like, for those moments on, and off the court. Spalding basketballs. True. We know what you do. Isolation is weird. Basketballs are in. Basketball for life. Mm. <laughs> do I like Hassan? Oh my god. I started yesterday, yeah. This is what coronavirus took for me. A lot of people are talking and saying like, oh, you know, my dad lost his job. Like, we don't know. We don't know what we're gonna do. We can't make the mortgage payments. Well, guess what? I was supposed to meet Exo Boo coming all the way from Switzerland to TwitchCon EU. So which one of us lost more, huh? Your dad and your family or me? No, I'm just kidding. I hope people don't take this seriously. Clip. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, that's, I'm, I'm joking. That's a joke. I'm making, 
a joke about my you are cleaning hardcore well i just touched your pocket pussy okay dude <laughs> um anyway you don't love the spirit of justice could have met ray too covid took it devil. off i know man as covid as took it off covid took it off god damn it Jamie took one look at Hassan and was like, I'm a Hey, it's fun. <laughs> Are you in love with Hassan? He's so cute. He's so cute. <laughs> You're attractive. I'll just say that. Right, that was such a weird era. I just dream about him. What about this good guy? What would That's you the best Hassan is the best sex I've had in my life. <laughs> um, yeah, hot. Yeah. I feel like you're probably like really, really, really good in bed, honestly. Although I'm not gonna lie, if I think if I saw Hassan's dick, I'd probably never want to ride another dick ever again. Don't tell him I said that. I don't know. Hassan just gives me the like the vibe that he could dominate me. Oh. Hassan, well look, you can put me through a wall. Like I. <laughs> that, was the worst one. Yeah. Like, that one was the most insane one to me. Cause that's not even hot. Yeah. Just being like, listen, you can fucking put me through a table. Hassan, you're so hot. You can take a halogen bulb and just smash it right in my face. <laughs> it's Bill Burr, dude. Put you through a fucking wall. That's it. You know? I'll put you, you through a fucking wall, dude. Wall, you you know? love your father the devil. How am I not in this? You were in this. You missed it, Quincy. You were. You're like towards the end. You don't love the spirit of justice. You love your father, the devil. the devil. This would be so weird if it was all a bunch of guys about Pokemon or Lily. Yes, because I'm receiving it and I like it. That's the difference. A lot of people do not understand the concept of consent. I am saying I'm receiving these compliments and comments and liking it. In the instance of Pokemon, it's probably not the same. Unless it was a bunch of hot dudes who were like, yeah, you know what? Like, Pokemon's pretty hot or some shit like that. Maybe she would find that to be uh, complimentary. Like, it's about attraction. Okay? So it's okay if you're hot. It's okay if you like that other person or if you don't find it, uh, if you don't find it uh, negative. You guys are being ridiculous. Every time we got to have this conversation, people are always like, bro, like, oh, you just like automatic consent. It's like, if you're hot, it's like automatic. Consent. It's like what you, you were failing to recognize justice. is you're still you securing your consent. Father, the devil. I will. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for the dono. There are incels in here. I know. What if it was all guys saying you're hot? I mean, listen, people know what my sexual orientation is, but there are plenty of dudes who say I'm hot. And what do I do? It's a compliment. I take it as a compliment. I'm not interested in having sex with them, but it's still a compliment. Right? Yeah. Anyway. I don't know. It's a gays only event, baby. Well, first of all, that's fake because we know. But again, here's the thing. I don't think all those comments are created evenly. And I made like we make commentary on the ones that are ridiculous. Like, put me through drywall probably isn't something you should be saying to someone. <laughs> that's my take. Good talk. I just, uh, sorry, uh, dude, look, 